Hi, this is Gary from Cheetah Transformation, and this is the 29th Smartsheet Quick Tip on how to calculate the number of working days between two dates using the Network Day formula. In this video, I'm going to show you how to calculate the number of working days between two dates in Smartsheet. So in this scenario, we have a number of tasks uh, together with the day uh, and two day columns to start and an end, and I'll explain why we've got the day in a second. So what Network Days day does is it calculates a number of working days between two dates however should the start date happen on either a Saturday or a Sunday um, then it will actually add a day on so how to calculate the number of days is equals network day highlight the start date comma and then the end date Let you see so it's 41 working days between these two dates here. If we make that a column formula, you can see it's calculated all those days. Now the ones that are highlighted, you can see that I've just used this formula here called week day, which shows me the, the day, uh, the number of the day that that starts on. So that one starts on, a, on a, um, a Sunday, and that one starts on a Saturday. So if I just unhide this column here, you can see I've got network days here, and network days all that does is actually calculate the number of working days between two dates. It doesn't mind whether or not it's on a Saturday or a Sunday. Um, and as you can see, for the task four, it's added a day on here because we started on uh, a Sunday. On here again, it's had another day on because it started on a Saturday. And again here, it's added a day on because it started on a Sunday. Now the good thing about network day is that if you go into your account settings here, if you go into plan and build, and then into account settings and then working days here you can see that you can signify the number of days now you have to have to be sysadmin on Smartsheet to do this so therefore actually if your working week was Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday um, then obviously um, Mondays and Sundays would not be your working days and actually Network Day would calculate that based on these settings here so there you have it that's how to calculate the number of working days between two dates in Smartsheet Thanks for watching, and for further details on our free and paid Smartsheet training courses, please visit the training and events section on our website at www.cheetahtransformation.co.uk. Alternatively, contact us directly on help at cheetahtransformation.co.uk to arrange a call to discuss your requirements further.